Here's how we create new feature layers. So first from your content page, click the create button and then select feature layer. And then from this box, you click build a layer. All right, here you can see you can put lines, points, polygons, or a one layer which contains all three. We're gonna do just individual layers. So if you need to click create a points layer, that's how you create a points layer. Right now we're gonna create lines next. So click on the lines selection and then you select create. And then from this box, you're going to click next. And then you're going to zoom in on the map to the just the general area where this data is going to be collected. So for your title, you need to create a unique title for this feature layer. So I recommend using your initials at the end because CSUN's uh, subscription will only allow unique feature layers across the entire CSUN um, account. All right, once you have your created your layer, go to its information page and click on data. And then when you're on data, you click a sub tab there on the right side of the page called fields. And you're gonna select fields and this is where you add fields to the attribute table. So click this add button and you're gonna type in a field name. Now we're just gonna call a generic field attribute item one. Now you're gonna see, I'm gonna type in item space one first and you'll see how this is going to be incorrect or it will not be um, accepted because we have to only use certain characters here. So for the field name, I'm gonna put item underscore one and then the display name item space one. And this is going to be a text field, so I'm going to leave it as string, and I'm going to click Save. And once that's done, I can go back to my content page and create another new feature layer. So I run that process all over again, build a layer. This time I'm going to create a polygons layer. Click Next. Run through the same steps again. Zoom in to just the general uh, area where the data is going to be collected. Entry title, I'm going to call it Polygon Layer 4404 with my initials. If you don't put your initials and you can just name, everybody tries to name this Polygon Layer for 404, it will not be saved uh, because it will not be a unique feature layer name. Remember that you have to put in a tag, so it's going to add a default tag there. You can keep that if you want. I usually try to keep my stuff organized by putting a tag related to the course. All right, once you've got your, your two layers, uh, well, next we've, we, we need to add our attribute here. So when you create a feature layer, it includes some default attributes, but you need, need to add the, any attributes for you to enter your own um, information. So it goes through the same process again. You go to the data tab for the layer. You're gonna go to fields and you're gonna click add for add field and just name another one item one and save. And once you've done that, you can open a new map. So if you have, if you, you can usually just click that map navigation button right there. And this is gonna bring up a new blank map. If this opens up a previous map that you have been working on, you'll have to kind of close that map out, close the browser and reopen it so you can get a, just a blank new map that says my map. You're gonna click add and under my content, you should be able to see the polygon layer and the line layer. And if you click the little plus symbol next to it, then it's gonna add it to your map and you're gonna see it right there. And the map, since this is a brand new empty feature layer, you're not gonna see anything on the map because you haven't collected the data yet. Okay, be sure to save your map. In this case, we're gonna call this line and polygon accuracy test. I would put my initials here um, uh, at the very end. Um, we're doing this accuracy test in Collector Classic. Um, add a tag and then save the map. And you're now ready to go. You can go into Collector Classic um, or whatever app that you're gonna be using and then download and uh, get ready for data collection.